Hello friends, welcome to Phuket, during Phuket Sandbox and after the crisis. Here I'm presenting a few hotels with a new SHA Plus standard that are worth visiting during the Sandbox time and also after the pandemic. And today we're staying at the Diamond Cliff Resort and Spa in Patong. So I'm actually completely taken aback by this amazing pool villa. I think this could be the best price value ratio you can have in a hotel in Phuket and maybe even in the whole country. A total recommendation. Now the whole family is already waiting for me in the car but before we start the hotel report you have to come with me on the whole car ride. And welcome to the Diamond Cliff Hotel. This place has been kind of my relative's neighbor for 33 years and now it's finally time to pay a visit. We were greeted by friendly staff and some non-alcoholic welcome drinks. It's a pretty big hotel, all built on a hill, but they have a very responsive shuttle service that brings you to your hotel room. But before going there, let's first check out one of the two pools. So here we are at the deluxe ocean view room and uh, that's the entrance. Here's the bathroom uh, that has a wind window into the room, but you can close the window by shades. Then we have a connecting door. I'm going to show that later. Then here's the little closet with um, bathrobes and slippers and laundry bag, of course. And then we have here Twin beds in this case, of course, you can also have the king bed option and a nice large TV, a very large fridge actually, and a nice large sofa and a fruit basket. And then of course the ocean view because this is an ocean view room. And if you wanna have two rooms with a connecting door like us, that's there too. This larger pool is more in the upper part of the hotel area and you see it's just a very beautiful pool and you see also there's nobody as well. You see there's a children's water slide over there and there's a very theatrical stage to present yourself on a day bed over there. Very beautiful and uh, well to be honest it feels very special. It feels a little bit like royal family, like the hotel would have waited for you. Um, I must admit it's very special and I have also to admit I would lie if I said that I would not really love this. Well who would have thought that I would ever stand not under a rose tree but a rose apple tree and here they are here at the Diamond Cliff Hotel on Phuket Island. These are the rose apples actually the small ones and they're called Chompu and they taste lightly sour and the locals eat them with a mix of salt, sugar and chili. And here we are at the Jacuzzi Ocean View Suite and let's have a look at the bathroom first. So here's the bathroom, nice and it's not huge but really nice walk-in shower with a rain shower and a window into the actual room. And there you saw already the jacuzzi. 
And first, let's have a look at the bed. You see that's a nice large bed uh, with a painted, I think, silk painting above the bed. It's very colorful. Maybe it's a little kitschy, but I think it's more beautiful than kitschy, so I really like it. They get the window again into the bathroom and some nice wooden furniture and... Uh, oops, that's me. And uh, here's the jacuzzi of the jacuzzi suite. Really nice, I think. And um, there's a sofa and then we have the balcony, the door to our balcony for the ocean view. And I mean, it's a really nice balcony. Um, the only downside is that it's directly by the street. So it's a little noisy from the street, but you have direct view to the sea. So it's up to you if you prefer to have it more silent and then not by the street or with direct sea view and a little more noisy. This was my stay at the super deluxe sea view room at the Diamond Cliff Resort here in Phuket and for the second night I decided for a little upgrade. Wow, <laughs> that's crazy. Ooh. Phuket has been one of the most famous and popular travel destinations in the world for many years. Due to the Covid crisis, however, the island's incredible development has been put on hold for an indefinite time. With the Phuket Sandbox project, however, you can also currently take a vacation on Phuket Island. However, you should check the special regulations for updates and I recommend official websites such as the Thai embassies over Facebook as there's way too much wrong information on social media at the moment. Now let's turn left to this villa and you see already there's a beautiful outside rain shower and on the left side of that, that door over there, that's a sauna, a dry sauna. But now we go up and open this door that leads into the one of the two pool villas. And here you see it's a beautiful entrance. And I'm closing and locking the door here with this thing so we are alone for a moment. So, here we are. Now it's getting really interesting and really amazing to be honest. Here you have this huge, huge, uh, beautiful king size bed under a beautiful wooden ceiling, all just very nicely done. And from here, you have a view out to the pool. And, uh, well, I couldn't care less about the TV because here's a beautiful, huge sofa and a view onto Kalim Bay. That's the northern part of Patong Bay. And uh, on we go. So let's check out the rest of this amazing place. Let's turn right for a moment. And here you see beautiful blue tiles, traditionally Thai tiles, by the way. And this is the walk into the jacuzzi room. Also with windows on three sides, a waterfall for the jacuzzi bathtub and beautiful light on the ceiling. And I cannot believe here I am. Beautiful um, sink as well. 
and then we go on. Let's turn right again. So here we have, a, um, I don't know what you call this, a beauty mirror maybe, and uh, some more, another sink to, yeah, to wash yourself. And uh, here we have a walking closet. So here you see already you have the bathrobes and everything else. And um, everything is so nicely done, you see, with granite and beautiful stones and wood. And there you can already have a preview for outside, because here you have another sliding glass door and leads outside to this tree. And that's not only a tree, it's a real tree, not fake. It's a real tree, just amazingly put here. And we have another outside rain shower, private, just, just beautiful. And uh, here we have the toilet and bidet and you can open and close this beautiful with these sliding wooden doors and another room that's the regular shower room which is far beyond regular and uh, yeah I cannot believe I'm here <laughs> and I think this is the best value or one of the best values you can have in the country so uh, much about this villa of the three houses of this two so-called two-bedroom villa which is actually three houses If you like my flight and travel reports, please give me a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, do it right now with the bell notification. It costs you just one click, I'm really happy and you're making a big difference for the future of this channel. And now let's have a look on this right villa over here. bedroom pool villa that's not for sleeping but for staying and I would say that calling this place here a two bedroom pool villa is a little understatement because it's actually two villas with a bedroom each and then this place that's actually not for sleeping but for yeah staying so let's start here that's me in the mirror again <laughs> uh, bling bling but on a very nice level and then we have this look outside onto this beautiful little pond with a fountain. And here's the living room with these very nice fans, a large TV screen. And I could not care less about that because it's all so beautiful here. You see this beautiful wall relief outside there. And then here we have the large dining table. Very nice too. 
and uh, a coffee corner and uh, these beautiful two antique pieces very famous uh, Thai figurines or figures yeah figurines and um, yeah and then the door opens up into the kitchen finally I can cook again and well no kidding I'm not gonna cook here I'm not gonna use the time for this I love cooking but not today and uh, yeah so that's the part of the two bedroom pool villa that's not a bedroom and here you have the view outside onto the pools and onto the sea and the ocean so the family is having tea inside and that's the perfect timing to have a look at the pool area of the pool villa the two bedroom pool villa which is actually two villas with a bedroom each and another villa in the middle anyway here's the pool you have one jacuzzi another one jacuzzi and then we have this beautiful steps into the pool then there's a little extra pond with a waterfall and the rain shower over there and left of that is the sauna and then we have this beautiful house which is actually just for staying there's the living room and kitchen in there and then we have these little steps that go over to the little pavilion so i'm walking there with dry feet almost like a well let's not say like a prophet but prophet but i feel pretty divine at the moment and we have the beautiful view over Kalim Bay and Patong Bay and here's again left side a bedroom villa the beautiful pool the main villa in the middle just to stay and the other bedroom villa on the other side sunset hour and being in a private pool surrounded by such a beautiful pool villa and such an amazing view well can it get any better i doubt it The Diamond Cliff Hotel here in Phuket is the best example for how amazing vacation in Thailand can be right now. Uh, actually, it's a win-win situation for both hotels and customers. Uh, the hotels, especially private hotels, hotels like this one that don't belong to a chain, can um, plan a little ahead with uh, the income they have. They can keep their staff not only paid but also trained so they stay used to how it is to uh, be hosting customers and the customers the hotel guests get beautiful rooms at the moment at quite unbelievable prices really like this pool villa that I'm staying at right now I got at a fraction of the regular price and that's really quite amazing and just an example how wonderful vacation can be right now in Thailand um, during the COVID crisis of course with a sense for safety and for staying healthy um, with a sense for keeping others out of risk and yourself as well but i think that's um, important in any situation of life and also during vacation so once again i think if you have the time to do that this is the time to visit thailand i hope you liked this excursion to yet another special hotel with extra value in phuket Please give me a thumbs up if you did and subscribe. Are you planning a vacation in Thailand now or after the crisis? I'm looking forward very much to all your feedback in the comments.
Of course, there's more reports coming up about Phuket, Thailand and beyond. And of course, new exciting flight reports too, because there's always stories to tell. Stay tuned and see you again soon here at Travel Sing Fly. Thank you.